hello guys welcome back to my channel this is nana's food well today is special guys you have to come along with me we are doing tuna jollof rice and also i'm unboxing my new favorite pot okay it's so 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 good to use just look at the jollof rice it's amazing come along with me and let's do this so guys let's unbox my favorite pot okay this pot is from bag Ops Eurocars professional series as you can see there i bought it in costco all right and guys it is the best of the best it's really lightweight and it's very very easy to clean because food doesn't really stick at the bottom okay yeah it doesn't stick to the pan it's so amazing let's open it up okay and see what we have there look at the glass lid yeah it has a glass lid but this the reason why mainly i bought this is we can just easily transfer it from the hob to the oven yeah it can be used as a bakeware all right the glass can withstand high temperatures so as you can see it is a very 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 good buy this is not a paid promotion i just love it and i want you to know about it all right so guys it is really 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 easy to use I just bought it for just to cook <laughs> jollof rice. I needed a pan for my cooking jollof rice because I cook jollof rice a lot. But now I use it for everything. Try this, guys. I need to save money to buy all the rest of the series. It is so, so good. So you have to try it and buy it. Just type the name onto the website. Go to their website and you can just purchase it from there. Okay? It's so, so good. And just look how beautiful it looks so guys try this and then you love it let's make some jollof rice so guys i'm using tuna for this jollof rice so i'm adding some chopped onions to the oil right on the tuna okay the sunflower oil and i'm going to just cook the onions until it's nicely cooked and translucent i'm going to add some curry powder to it yes guys i love curry powder it makes everything nice okay so and i'm adding the tuna so this is just the tuna chunks onto it and i'll cook it a little bit and then i'm going to add my all-purpose jollof stew okay i've done it if you don't know how to do it check my youtube channel you'll find my all-purpose jollof stew so i'll allow it to cook and i'm going to add some green peas I love green peas who doesn't like green peas it makes it quite sweeter and lovely so it's, this is very quick recipe i'm going to add my rice it's so quick guys because the steam is already done okay add my rice and i like just frying the rice in the stew for a bit before i add the water right so after frying it for some while i add a bit of hot water i'm using jasmine rice so i need just a bit of water to cook my rice and i'm going to put this into the oven guys yes right i did cover it with kitchen foil okay i didn't show it here but i covered kitchen foil and I put that into the oven checking my rice okay take it out of the oven and then open it up as you can see yeah so i losing the rice a bit and i just realized i need just a teeny weeny bit of water and i'm going to add a bit of water to it and then cover it again and put it back into the oven So guys, checking my jollof rice again, just took it out of the oven, as you can see, and I am taking out the kitchen foil. Guys, I'm losing it up and I just realized, yes, it is cooked. It is cooked nicely, guys. So try investing into this pot. You are going to love it. You can cook anything in the oven. So if you like this recipe, give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. And do put on your post notifications so that when I put up a new video, you will be notified. Thanks so much for watching and may God richly bless you. Don't forget to share. Bye.